My Fender Strat has returned from surgery at Charlie Chalmers Guitar Experience and I now have big stainless steel frets with a Thornbucker Plus humbucker in the bridge. The refret included the use of their Plex station, which scans to an accuracy of a thousandth of a millimeter to give a perfect guitar setup. The resulting fretwork is incredible and I definitely made a great decision in having Charlie do the work on my Strat. When discussing wiring for the Thornbucker Plus humbucker, Charlie and I decided that one tone control would alter the bridge pickup, the other tone control would alter the neck pickup, and there'll be no tone control for the middle pickup. I wanted to keep the neck pickup and position 4 of combined neck and middle pickup tones unchanged, and also make full use of the new humbucker pickup. Here is a clean tone using the neck pickup. For clean, funky type rhythm playing, I mainly use the neck pickup and the position 4 combination of neck and middle pickups. Position 2 now gives me a combination of split humbucker and middle pickup. Apparently I can vary the blend of the position 2 via control inside the guitar, although I'll play the guitar as it is for a while before making any further modifications. Here is a comparison of various pickup combinations for clean rhythm tones. I was slightly concerned about the volume difference between the humbucker and the single core pickups, although I needn't have worried as they are perfectly balanced. Here is an example of swapping between the neck pickup and the bridge humbucker. <laughs> The only change I might make is to remove the treble bleed kit that's been installed, as this has drastically changed the taper of the volume control. Charlie did warn me that this would happen, although I'm going to gig the guitar for a while before making the decision to remove it. So, there you have it. I'm loving my newly modified Strat, and I sure have missed big frets. The Strat is now so much easier to play. I hope you found this video helpful, especially if you're considering any modifications to your own Strat. If you have any questions, please leave a comment, and I will do my best to help. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a like and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss more videos of cool guitar stuff coming soon. Bye for now.